Hey, I'm Desmond Lane, Peach Specialist at Clemson University, and welcome to the Clemson Tiger Peach Network. Welcome back to everything about grapefruits. <laughs> I mean really large peaches. Today is the 20th of July 2011 and it's a blistering hot day up here in Chesney, South Carolina at James Cooley's farm where I have my variety test block. This is our second season of everything about peaches and this summer's series is called Peach Picks for South Carolina and every week throughout the entire growing season we're featuring those cultivars that perform extremely well here in the tastier peach state. You know, when it comes to peaches, your favorite doesn't last very long. In fact, most cultivars were looking at about a two week harvest window. And as you remember last week, we featured Windblow, which is my personal favorite. It's your traditional Southern peach. It's got yellow flesh. It melts in your mouth, sweet and juicy with some tanginess to it. Super delicious. Well, the next variety in sequence after Windblow that is really excellent is called July Prince. And July Prince has many of the same traits that Windblow does, but one thing that's a little bit different is it's even bigger. It's very much known for its size. In our Clemson University research trials over the last several years, the performance of July Prince has been excellent. July Prince was developed by the United States Department of Agriculture in Byron, Georgia. The breeder was Dr. Dick Oakey, and it was released to the public in 2008. Because it is a public release, you can freely propagate it. July Prince is a consistently large peach. It averages between three and three and a half inches in diameter, and that's really excellent for a peach this time of the year. It's got a nice yellow background color and a red over color or blush that gives it that really attractive combination to make it a very pretty peach. It's got a very nice uniform round shape. When you cut through the skin into the flesh, you can see that it's got yellow flesh and there's also some red pigmentation in the flesh. Nothing to worry about. Those are anthocyanin pigments, which are excellent antioxidants, making it a health benefit for you. It's also free stone and it's melting flesh type. If you'll remember last week when I tasted Windblow, I was sort of <laughs> knocked off my feet when you're head over heels in love for something, it's hard to imagine that you could find something that would be as good or even better. So let's see how July Prince tastes. Wow. Mmm. That is delicious. Sweet, juicy. If I was to eat some more of it, it would be dripping off my elbows. In fact, it's the sweat right now that's dripping off my elbows. This is a very nice peach. It's got all the things you're looking for in a summertime treat. Why don't you join us next week when we'll feature another peach pick for South Carolina. You know, making these videos is a whole lot of fun because of course I have to taste all these peaches in the process and since we make lots of mistakes while we're recording it, I get to taste them lots of times. Anyway, being a peach specialist, it's a rough job. Mm. Somebody's got to do it. For more educational videos and information about peaches, you can visit my Everything About Peaches website at www.clemson.edu slash peach. And if you'd like to read my columns for the American Fruit Grower magazine, you can visit their website at www.growingproduce.com.